Hey, what's up, guys? Let's get it straight into it. You know, another disappointing display by the NBA. I, I can't believe it. You know, I, I cried. I cried when Jokic got ejected from this game. The momentum was swinging. You know, Jokic, <sighs> flagrant to my ass, bro. He, he hit the ball. He wasn't aiming to hurt anyone. He wasn't trying to hurt Cameron Payne. He went, he got all ball, dude. Cameron, so if you put your face in front of the ball you and you you can't go for the ball what the fuck dude joke i'm really really disappointed in the game you know like i said in my previous video i just want to see competitive basketball dude i'm so sick of injuries i'm so sick of the refs having so much dictating power over like they they just eject the mvp they just eject the other team's best player in an elimination game in the playoffs Come on, there's another agenda here to bring in money from networks. It has to be, you know, they, they, they want to keep it this way, soft. They want to keep it, any aggression needs to be punished instantly. That's what that's what I got. As soon as I saw the, the referees taking that, that sort of longer time and that there was an altercation after, that went into their decision, 110%. This was my favorite part of the whole thing. When you saw Jokic, he's, he's Serbia, bro. He ain't scared. He was going to eat Booker. He was going to eat Booker up. He would have just chewed him up. You've seen his brothers at the MVP ceremony. Jokic ain't no joke. He's a strong dude. He's nice as, nice as anything, but he was going to eat Booker. He was not scared. Man, I can't believe he got ejected. Mike Malone was just heartbroken. I'm heartbroken for him. I'm heartbroken about the game. Hey, you can argue the Suns were going to win anyway. Or they were up 3-0 in the series. But I just want to see competitive games. Dude, I don't want to see people get swept because their best player was ejected. Their best player is injured. I don't want to see that. No one wants to see that. And the NBA needs to wake up to themselves and set and and understand that it's hurting them more than it's helping them right now. They're ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. But, hey, give Chris Paul... See, Chris Paul played an amazing game, and it's just going to go underappreciated because Jokic gets ejected. Chris Paul, 37 points. He hasn't scored that many points in over four years. Amazing game. Devin Booker is amazing. This Suns team has the opportunity now to win the whole thing. You know, Utah is facing injuries if they get through the Clippers. And the Clippers, uh, I don't see the, the Clippers ain't beating the Suns. Chris Paul will just get in, um, in Paul George's head. It'll, it, I, I got the Suns winning. If, if Utah is healthy, I got the Suns taking it all the way. Now with all this rest, it's going to do wonders for Chris. You know, see what happens in the Bucks next series. This Suns team is better than anyone in the in the East with our Kyrie and James Harden playing with KD. But there's something else going on here, guys. There, there has to be. Uh, this is a message to you, NBA. You're going down a slippery slope. You're going down a path. You know, you're making decisions. These referees aren't making decisions on their own. They're being told what to do. They're being told before the games, if this happens, show no mercy. They're not making the decision here. You think a referee is making the decision to eject an MVP in an elimination game? You're crazy. You're crazy. Highly disappointed in the NBA as a fan. You know, I, I didn't care really who was going to win this series. I thought I liked them both. But this is just severely disappointing. Severely, severely disappointing. Oh well. I wanted to see who, who wins the Clippers and Jazz now. Like I said, if Donovan's not healthy, Clippers are going to win. Utah has no chance without Donovan Mitchell playing. If Sixers remain healthy, like I said in my last video, man, it's whoever's healthiest wins this fucking thing. I'm fucking sick of it. What are you, what are you supposed to do?
You know, sit your players until the playoffs. It's fucking stupid, man. Ugh. I just feel bad for Jokic, man. That's heartbreaking. That's so heartbreaking. Man. Oh, well. On to the next one. You know, we got more games tomorrow. So, stay tuned. Thanks for watching. You know, like, comment, subscribe. Appreciate the support. You guys really, really do. So, Peace.